Hello, this is the voice of Dylan Flynn. Hi, this is the voice of Trevor Ickrath. And you are listening to the final ever episode of Wordle with Friends, the show where two friends do the Wordle. The show where two friends did the Wordle for a whole year, but now we're finally here and it's freaking over. And I'm not going to say I won't miss it sitting down with you every single day like clockwork to do this little word puzzle that we have come to love so much but man it's nice to have made it to the end of the road isn't it to see the finish line in sight it's a lot of things man i'm feeling it today dude yeah it's an emotional occurrence like i don't think anybody could deny that especially after the the long walk down memory lane that these uh little past four now five bonus episodes have been. I I couldn't have been happier with our postseason. I've I just think it all turned out so lovely, and I can't believe this is it. I've just been thinking like, damn, today's gonna be the last time I say this. Today's gonna be the last time I do this. That's so crazy. That is pretty wild. It's the last time I'll ever tell our listeners uh, how they can get in touch with us. I know, which is going to be really fun. Well, for obvious reasons. But, I mean, you you said that you couldn't be more pleased with how these this final run of bonus episodes worked out. I feel that way just about the entire series, man. You know, I think, like, we pretty much nailed it. Like, we didn't miss an episode. Neither of us ever struck out. We had a couple, like, really exciting holes in ones and stuff like that. It was a wild ride. There were days, don't get us wrong. There were days where sitting down to do this was a fucking chore. There were days where you didn't want to be here. I didn't want to be here. It was 100% out of the obligation. But taken on the whole, like, what an incredible thing to have done, you know? And there there were days where it wasn't always easy to actually get the show recorded either i mean we had some real near misses we had some crazy shit you remember that (laughs) time when you taped your half of the episode in in the fucking uh atlanta airport and the delta concierge was like the uh, the main character of the episode (laughs) i think that was the new orleans airport actually oh yeah that's right just so many different places we've recorded this show beaches in front of Dairy Queens, uh, next to next to teacup rides, this show has taken you all over the country. <laughs> but I think there's nothing else to say now. But it is Sunday, March fifth, twenty twenty three, and Trevor and I are about to attempt to solve Wordle number six twenty four. And this is your warning to turn back now if you've not yet done today's puzzle, as there will be spoilers ahead. That's right, and our as our resident even Steven, I will be uh, kicking things off for the final time today. I can't believe, I'm so happy this burden is not on me. I, th- I, feel, I feel the weight of this moment. I'm excited about it because I, I have the perfect word to play. I always thought you were better at this than me, by the way. You know, I didn't want to say, but I also kind of had a sneaking suspicion i feel like you kind of nail these openers let's let's see how you feel about this one coming your way okay off to a little bit of a slow start on this final episode i got one yellow letter for playing the word final final that's the one yeah very good i wonder i'd like this to be an a and e word so let's keep the a Oof. um here's a weird one how about this hey if there was ever an opportunity that I would recommend you play a weird word. It's got to be right now. <laughs> Here comes a word with your A and a slot 5 A. Let's see what it gets me. Nice. Five gray letters. <laughs> Oof, okay. For a second, I thought you just got it. <laughs> no, I played the word barge. Okay, barge. There, I think there definitely was a version of this episode where uh, we just threw caution in the wind and played all of the like wackiest fun words that we could think of, like... I'm playing anime, you're playing yeah. gamer, somebody's yeah, playing yeah, yeah. waifu, stuff like that, you know? Yeah, I do feel like we haven't left too much on the table. Like, most of the good five-letter words have been played over the course of this series, I feel like. You gotta imagine the majority of five-letter words, period, have been played over the course of this series, right? Yeah, outside of, like, your your questionable Palak Shaw ones, and even some of those. I mean, <laughs> you played Plaque with a CK, so <laughs> we've, we've tapped into the weird ones. All right, so you got nothing for barge. Nothing. Nothing. All right. So no no fifth slot E, huh? That would have been just too good to be true, I guess. Too good to be true, but we salute you, fifth slot E. You've been a, oh, yeah. one, a lovely companion. We'll, we'll never forget you. So what do I want to play here? What about this? I'm ready. I'm ready. 
Oh, that's got one letter in common with Barge. I'm just gonna do it because you know it's got one letter in common. You got nothing. I'm sure you're I not got gonna... nothing. So you know that'll be great. But maybe you'll get some action somewhere else. Here we go. Okay, I'm up to two yellows and one green for playing the word choir. Choir. So you got that I, huh? That's right. But did I place it? But did you place it? Or did I place one of the new letters that have entered the picture? I feel like if it's the O and the I, you would have locked them both down. Hmm. Maybe I could do something with that H or that C. I wonder if we're looking at something like... Here's one that does not work because it doesn't have any of the stuff in the same spot. Oh, is is it this? Is this going to be the salt? Hmm. Maybe Trevor's reckoning with what the final... I almost said the final solution. Oh, God. <laughs> the final solve on an episode of Wordle with Friends is going to be, this is what I'm trying to get at. Yeah. I don't think it could be that. Currently not really seeing too much. If this is going to be the solve, I can't say I'm, like, thrilled that this is going to be, like, the last one. It doesn't feel like <laughs> a great one to go out on, but, like... Uh -huh whatever you know it's the it's the random number generator you know absolutely um i wonder if this works no it doesn't because everything else in final besides the i was gray right that's correct you're waiting a little while but hey savor it oh yeah i mean who knows the next time i'll be able to sit silently on a mic as i listen to you puzzle out what the wordle solution might be it, this might never happen again i maybe just found something okay I think this is uh, legal, so let's try it. Tell me what you're doing here first before you uh, actually play the word. I'm going to leave your I uh, where you placed it. Okay. And I'm going to keep your O and your C and move them. All right. So let's see what, it, what that gets me. <laughs> One last fucking time, it got me four green letters. Oh my gosh, are you kidding? <laughs> What'd you play? I played the word topic. Okay. God damn it. So it's got to be this thing that I'm, I'm looking at. Uh, yeah, it, it must be then, huh? Topic would have been a better one, though, I think. Yeah. What are we if not, like, you know, topical guys over here? Oh, yeah. Holidays, current events. That's our bread and butter on this show. We're so good at being topical. I'm going to play this word. Five green letters. The game is over. Uh, I guess we. this one goes out to Britney Spears. Uh, the final ever. Round three solve on Wordle with Friends history is toxic, but we tied. I like it. I'm definitely glad we ended in a tie. It would have felt weird if one of us had won the final match of the show, I think. I just, uh, I got to take a second here, buddy, to just tell you that I'm fucking so proud of this show. <laughs> yeah, I know. Like, feel, feels kind of feels kind of silly to say maybe it's like our greatest creative achievement, but uh, I think we... It sounds so dumb. I, <laughs> I'm so dumb to say it, but I I can't tell you how how fulfilled I am by this. And I'm so thankful for all the people who uh, joined us along the way and tuned in. Oh, I have a list. I have a list. I made a list. Okay. Let me do the list. Okay. I want to thank, we want to thank Maxton Sedstrom, Chris Meyer, Tracy Bennett, Jeff Smith, Laura Nichols, Ben Pitt, Erica Lindbeck, Brandon Hoff. Sorry, I'm a fucking mess. You're crying right now. Ryan Hughes. My Aunt Marielle, my mom, Stacy, all the A&E people who recorded messages for that one fucking weird episode we did. Absolutely. Yeah, can't forget them. Also, that guy on Fiverr I hired once to do a voiceover. I want to thank everyone who's ever written a comment or an email to the show. I want to thank any of you who, who found us on TikTok and then came over and joined us on YouTube. I want to thank uh, those of you who shared with us that you played Word with Friends with your loved one. That's fucking so cool. And I want to thank anyone who's ever watched, if it was every day or every once in a while, all of you have made this year so special and so cool to us. And Trevor, I fucking love you, buddy. You're my creative other half on, on this show, and I can't wait to work with you again. And I'm just so proud of this thing that we built together. <laughs> I thought that was extremely moving. We've also got to give, you know, a big shout out to uh, other such uh, greats who contributed to the show, such as Fifth Slot E. Of course. Uh, uh, those robots that Jeff made. Yeah, those <laughs> robots. Josh Wardle, Palak Shaw. Josh Wardle's girlfriend. Oh, yeah, that's a real name I forgot. The first main character, like the first real like recurring character on the show, I feel like. Yeah, we, we really had it out for those two at the beginning. <laughs> yeah. Other than that, I, I, I don't know... Uh, 
what are some good final thoughts to say? Um, I guess, you know, in the end, the words you say really are equal to the letters you play. <laughs> That's poignant, buddy. I appreciate it. I appreciate that. You know what I would appreciate? Getting an email from our <laughs> listeners. Maybe they could write in and tell us how much they enjoyed going on this crazy ride with us. Tell us how great a job we did. Tell us how much they'll miss the show. If you want to say any of that stuff, you can send us an email at wordlefriends at gmail.com. You could also find the show on TikTok or Twitter by searching Wordle Friends. And if you want to go watch all the episodes on YouTube, uh, why not, for all time's sake, subscribe to the channel, uh, click the bell to get notifications, even though I don't know when another one of those would ever go out. Uh, or just leave us some comments, because those will be cool little monuments in history now. But for now, and I guess really for always this time, I've been Dylan Flynn, and I love all of you guys. And for now and forever... I've been Trevor, oh. Ickrath, that is. I fucking love that. And we sure appreciated having you along for the ride on the show where friend is a five-letter word. This has been a production of The Lighthouse Keepers Company. Culture Illuminated.